This is Uncle Momo's music reaction channel where I provide my views on talented artists from around the world and we are going over to Indonesia or checking out this amazing Indonesian artist Pichi Ariani. Now I've just uploaded a song from Pichi Ariani that I believe that I have already reacted to before but I didn't so it was a nice pleasure. So this is um, Pichi Ariani sung, I believe she sung this song three times. This is the third time that she's done this song, the Bohemian, uh, Bohemian Raspberry, um, cover of Queen. Um, so this is in, let me, it's got Hut Transmedia. Um, it also says this channel doesn't even earn 1% profit from this YouTube channel and all 100%, um, all are 100% free, um, journey to, um, Angelina, um, Putri and, uh, Putri and Riani's journey to international stardom. Um, so it also says, look, please uh, subscribe to her channel. And to, that would be lovely. So, so far it's gathering just over 10,000 views. It could be a little more. Um, sorry, 10,000 views since it was uploaded on December the 15th. So this is her on her stage. Um, please check out Outsource Data Capture Services. That's the channel where it's on. Please show your support. It's got 6,304 subscribers. Maybe loads of you have um, already, especially the reactors. But look, don't forget to give a shout out to where you got the actual download from everybody's got to grow and you know we just give respect where respect is due so that's outsource data capture services good day to you sir and thank you very much for uploading this uh particular um performance so without further ado you know what we're here for great vocabs and a damn good video audio music can you dig it Why is there this big massive door, like a red door? Do you see the guy hiding behind the screen? I don't understand the massive door and it being red like a red flame and door. Look at the crowd You gotta let me understand about this door and this red thing happening. I'm sure there's an explanation. Mama just killed a man. Put a gun against his head. Put my trigger now he's dead. Mama. Life had just begun, but now I've got it thrown it all. I'm going to press pause right there. So, look. We all love Pichi Arani. She's absolutely amazing and adorable and I'm a firm fan and always continuing her journey. This particular performance looks like there's a flames on the, um, on the stadium with a massive door and like a doorway to hell. I'm going to call it out as, as it is. It looks like the flaming stage, uh, not flaming stage, like there's a screen like, Mama just killed a man, put a bullet to his head. So I'm thinking that that's a sin. He's killed a man. Do you know what I mean? So he's going to go to hell for doing that. Um, so I think that is that the gate to hell? And if this so, then who's thought of that idea? Do you know? I could be totally wrong on this. But, but as soon as I'm, I'm, exclude, I'm excluding Pichi Ariani right back now because, you know, we all love her and everything else. I'm talking about the stage presence. We've got here a flames and a massive door, like there's a doorway to a giant or something going through this stage, um, going through this stairway to hell. And they've dressed up all in red and all that stuff. So it is kind of like a, a medieval kind of way of constructing it, um, where it's more of um, and the morbidity kind of th feeling. Um, structure rather than it being I mean there's many ways to sing this song and we've seen her sing, sing it two ways so this is a completely different way for me um 
So that's why I paused. I thought, well, you know, out of everything, that's something that's playing on my heart at the moment. Like, oi, what's going on here? What, where, what angle are you taking this from? Who's th whose idea was this? Like I said, I could be completely wrong. Um, and I'm not saying, I'm not saying nothing about Pucciariani. I'm talking about the stage present and somebody's idea of putting Pucciariani in this position. I'm like, let me know about this history of this nature. Or anything. Maybe it's me that needs to understand. But if you can see what I can see and you agree with what I can see, but you haven't said anything about it, then maybe I'm the first one to say something. Then I'm going to say it, you know, because I love it that much. <laughs> Simple as. Right. I'm going to go back just a little bit. What's going on on stage? It almost brings the song into a different kind of meaning. See the beat, like, it's like a heartbeat. Too late, my time is come. Send shivers down my spine. Bodies take it all the time. Goodbye, everybody. I've got to go. Gotta leave you all behind and face the truth. I know the song is about, you know what I'm talking about, but the brief, they thick on. Okay, there's people standing around. Is that the choirs or something? I see a little oh, that's lovely. silhouette of a man. <laughs> this is <laughs> But are they actually singing? Is it go? Is it go? Will you let or is me it go? More of a, um, rock? They're not really panning so close to the choir to find out if they are actually singing them, but if it's them. Guess what? Everybody loses that this song, don't they? <laughs> You know how hard this song is to sing? I tell you, you've got to have strength, core strength from beginning all the way to end. It doesn't... It doesn't, it doesn't die down. It's just full of energy all the way through. You have to give props to Queen, man. Seriously. The whole battle. See that jump, I can't I see it. Trend seven live TV. To me. Brilliant. Amazing.
Loved it. So that was Pucci Ariani, third time that she has sung this song. And this one looked a bit for me at the beginning, very kind of like morbid kind of like the, the state. You can see that's the gates to heaven, like the door to, he to, to, to hell kind of thing. I can't get away from that. Um, but I, I do understand that the theme, I do understand the angle of the, the artist that wants to go in that direction. But was that the right direction? I don't know. It's, it's an artist's, um, what do you call it? It's from an artist's perspective. All we know is that Pucci Ariani always executes her songs in a fabulous way and we enjoyed it tremendously. And no matter what position you put her in, if, you, if she knows a song and she sings it, she's going to execute it to her best ability and we're going to love it and adore it even more than what we already adore right now. So it's lovely to see. I've also, like I said to you before, I will be going into the collaborations of um, amazing artists that she has collaborated with until she does bring out her uh, as a second song for us to uh, adore, which is also written, will be written by her and uh, you know the the camera will be filmed by her father and the dress sense uh, of the fashion will be carried out by her mother and you know that that strong family participation which which is missing from the um, in music industry which i hold wholeheartedly i really do so like i said before hats off to outsource um data captured services thank you very much for uploading that for everybody else to see um hut transmedia live 22 you have got amazing amount of artists that i haven't yet touch but i certainly will be going into um it's very very intriguing um i'm kind of sh um, shocked that um you've only got about six thousand uh subscribers quite even more shot over however that it's only got about um this performance has only got ten thousand views not even reaching twelve thousand views yet surely we can do much more than that i'm sure that they're gonna have reactors reacting to this song that's gonna have more views than that and that's a that is a shame that is a really really shame especially if they're that's what i'm saying you better give props to where Props is due. If you're good, if you're gonna download it from a particular channel, knowing that your views may escalate much more than the original channel, give the original channel some props. That's what I'm saying. Until next time, I salute you. Boom.